Hey lovelies, I'm back with a simple wine curl style on the lace frontal change out unit that I did in the previous video. I just wanted to show you guys how the unit's been holding up and also how I style on a day to day basis. Now I call this my Frankenstein unit because I had to actually take different parts in order to get it to where it is today. Now the unit was flat ironed two days ago about 300 to 400 degrees so it's already flat ironed, already straightened. So I decided to just throw some wand curls in there to give it a little bit of body. Now if you haven't seen my lace frontal change out video, make sure to check out the description box below because it will be linked down there. I didn't do anything special in order to achieve these curls. All I did was pick out the hair, comb it out just to make sure all the tangles were gone. And then I just started wine curling the hair starting from the back. On this frontal, the baby hairs pop out really easily. I don't necessarily have to do anything major to get them to pop out. And I try not to use so much product on the edges because it can cause flaking and you can have like this white sheen on your edges if you use too much products. Try to, uh, try to use a lot of oil based or just very light holding products. Just give me the um, hint of baby hairs, but I try not to keep them so uniform when I slip them down. Next, spray on your favorite liquid based heat protectant so the hair isn't weighed down. When I wind curl my units, I usually keep the hair on the barrel for about 15 to 30 seconds. Just keep in mind the longer you keep the hair on the barrel, the tighter the curl is going to be and also the more likely for heat damage. Just a reminder, the lace frontal in the front has a kinky straight texture and in the back it's a Italian yakky texture and I haven't had problems at all blending these two textures together. Here's a close up of the hairline on this unit which I am absolutely loving. Now it's a blend of my own baby hairs with the lace frontal baby hairs without product. Now I wanted a lot of body in this style that I was doing so I made sure to put a lot of curls at the crown. Here's a close up of the parting on the lace frontal. Here are the wine curls before they're fluffed out. If you wanted to, you could just wear the curls like this. I fluffed them out. Um, I wanted a more of a loose curl, so I just went through the hair and just ran my fingers through. And then I followed it up with using a medium hold spritz. Now if you have a little bit too much volume or puff, all you got to do is take your wand curl to flatten the areas you want to lay down. Last but not least, looking down those baby hairs. Um, every time I look at these and start styling them, I feel like I got to cut them a little shorter. Um, I just feel like they're a little bit too long. Uh, I've had this olive oil pomade edge slick stuff for years. I then forgot about it. It's been in my closet. So I've seen a couple other YouTube videos that they've been using this product. So I tried it and I'm still learning how to use it. So yeah, I can. my baby hair is looking a little clumpy, but um, I go back in and fix them later. After I get my baby hairs and the unit laid exactly how I want to, I just go behind everything with a medium hold spray in order to make sure my curls last throughout the day. And voila lovelies, this is the finished look. I hope this video was helpful and don't forget, comment, rate, and subscribe. And in the comment box below, just let me know what you guys think of the unit. And until next time, stay lovely and 